Crazy Talk Animator 2 has brought users a whole new experience in 2D animation. And in the new 2.1 update, not only does it include enhanced functions for our legacy users, but it also includes some exciting news, the much requested Crazy Talk Animator 2 for Mac. So let's start with the new features. First, have you ever wished to place custom animations into everyday presentations or other applications? Well, in this update, users will finally be able to easily copy and paste their animations as transparent PNGs and animated GIFs to make PowerPoints more interesting. In the Mac version, users will be able to instantly export their animations with transparent backgrounds in MOV output to later composite in external video editors. This update not only allows users to adjust the color of vector-based items, but also to adjust the color for image-based items with the help from the Render Style panel. For color toning, users can simply set up the color style once and then copy the style from selected items and apply it to others without the need of adjusting separately. Line Width also enjoys an update, as besides being turned on or off, it can also be adjusted for specific needs. The Line Width is now fully optional when camera zooming or object scaling, allowing users to emphasize subjects with different Line Widths for dramatic effects. Ideal for conversations, using multiple text instances is now a cakewalk, as users can now create multiple dialogues in the same text bubble without any hassles. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, of course, of course. Additionally, there are enhancements for the character composer system. The mirror function will considerably speed up the character creation process, as users will only have to set up one side of the character sprites and then click the mirror button to have all the adjacent parts update automatically. With the vector grouping tool, users can simply check the select same color option to select all the vector shapes made with the same color to later assign them the same group name, making objects compatible with the render style feature. Before, when users needed to transform a single sprite, they had to modify all the others, which often took a lot of time. But now, with the All Pose Transform option, users can now apply the same transform results to other sprites in the library in one go. And of course, due to popular demand, Reillusion has added back most of the highly requested features that users enjoyed in the previous version of Crazy Talk Animator. Users can once again remove the backgrounds for face, body, and prop images thanks to the mask editor that comes with a manual and automatic mode making background removals a snap. The motion blending feature has also returned, allowing you not just to seamlessly combine 2D motion clips but also smooth out angle changes for 3D movements. Finally, Crazy Talk Animator 2 now supports both 32-bit and 64-bit Windows operating systems, which will bring users faster performances and bigger project size handling for larger high-quality projects. So update your Crazy Talk Animator 2 and make use of all these great improvements today!